Wilk's story. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Master's just too cool. He's the best. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Get anywhere like that. Do it like this. He knows how to do everything. I want to be just like him. Wilk, do you really look up to him? Huh? Of course. We are both talking about old Krusty Toast, right? He's the best. Master Bread saved my life. Huh? Really? Thing is, I've always been different from other milk boxes. Hmm. Doctor, why is the milk on top of his head spelled wrong? Is it harmful? Don't know. This is the first time I've seen this. However, I'm afraid nothing can be done about it. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, don't cry. <laughs> hey, nerd! Go in and take your hat off! I heard his milk is spelled with a W instead. Just take off the hat! It's not like hiding it will fix it. He's got a point. <laughs> no, uh, I'm the same as you guys. Mine says milk, too. Then take it off if that's uh, true. Huh? <laughs> his letter's upside down. That's rich. So all the rumors were right. Milk's first letter is upside down. That means his name is Rich. <laughs> We'll be there to save the day. Donut Rangers! Until we meet again, Red Ranger out! A local barbershop is not only fixing hair, it's turning lives around. Sometimes called the genius barber, Master Bread is gaining notoriety for being able to completely change the look of any bun, cake, or roll. Let's hear from some of the happy customers now. So what's your reason for coming here? Well, I was starting to have thinning hair, but now I feel confident to go out. And it's all thanks to the Bread Barber. Sounds like the place to be for anyone in need of a makeover. Red Barber? Good morning, sir. Are you him? The Master Barber? I heard all about you. They said you can fix anyone's look, can you? Uh, I guess. You need something? I do. Any chance you can fix this letter? Ah, I think you're a bit misspelled. Yeah. I was born as Wilk when I'm supposed to be Milk. Lots of medical specialists couldn't do a thing, but none of those doctors were you. Tough break. I don't think we can help you. Sorry, kid. Also, we're about to close. Please, sir, please. This W makes me look like a weirdo. This is my most desperate hour. Help me, Lord Kenobi. Get my only hope. <laughs> So you want me to change the W back into an M, huh? Uh, I'll see what I can do. <sighs> there. That looks nice. Uh, wow! That's the most amazing thing! Uh, come on! There must be something I can do. Aha! <clears throat> There, all done. Whoa! It looks good as new! I feel like an entirely new milk box! Thank you! Thank you so much! Uh. <laughs> Think of this another way. Your name is Wilk, right? Kid, you know why people come to my barber shop, right? Uh, why? Because they want to become unique! 
Every bakery item wants to feel special. They come here to become somebody new who stands out from the box of a dozen. So really, Wilk, you have the advantage. What do you mean? Think about it. Everyone and their mom has milk on their heads. But there's only one Wilk in the world. I'm just unique? Why, of course! I'm meant to be my own unique special hmm? box! Thank you uh, so much, Master uh, Bread! Thank you times a zillion! No problem. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. All right, get home safe. Whew, what a day. Time to go and Mr. rest. Mr. Bread! Uh, huh? I know I don't have any money, but... Please take this. Uh, it's my favorite Red Ranger, just for you. Thanks so much again. Mm. Bye! <laughs> mm. Mm -hmm. And so ever since that day, I've lived proudly as Wilk. Mr. Bread is a fountain of wisdom. I think he huh? told you all that just so he could go home early and you'd uh. leave. Impossible! Mm. Master Bread is always mm. sincere! Master Bread, you really tell Wilk all that stuff? What now? There's only one Wilk in the world. What are you talking about? Mm. Ah! Told you. Jesus Playground. <laughs> hey, Wilk, let's go and play. Uh, oh, oh, hi there, Cheese. Uh, I'm real swamped right now. Ask Choco? Not a chance. Can't you see I'm doing the books now? I'm trying to leave early today. Huh? Aw, everyone is busy. <clears throat> Cheese, huh? you're in grade school, for goodness sake. When are you going to stop messing around? Uh, when I was your age, I delivered uh, newspapers uh, in the morning. I worked my buns off in class each day and had a part-time job at the library at night. You really shouldn't be so lazy. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Hmm. If you got so much free time, take sausage for a walk. Walk sausage now? Sure, why not? Sausage, let's go, boy! <laughs> it's nice to get out of the shop for a bit, huh? huh? Whoa, wait up! Uh, uh, huh? Hey, it's a playground! <laughs> so you want to ride the seesaw? Uh, okay. Uh, is this how you do it? Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down! Uh, uh, it's no use! I don't know how to seesaw! I've never had any friends to play with on the playground before! <laughs> Could I join you guys on the slide? Oh, yeah, it's cheese. <laughs> it's not my grandpa. Get out of our playground, stinky. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Like, the air's already cleaner with him gone. <laughs> yes! I can breathe again! <laughs> <laughs> we had so much fun. Not anymore. <laughs> huh? Where are you off to? <laughs> A bunch of building materials just lying here. What'll you do with them? Oh, oh, it's a seesaw! Sausage, should we build our own slide and swing set? It's not perfect or anything, but it'll do nicely. What should we try first? Uh. Huh? Hmm. You call this junkyard a uh. playground? 
Hmm, does this scrap heap even function? It's rather filthy. Uh, who are you all? Since you're asking such a silly question, <sighs> it seems we'll have to enlighten you. <laughs> the name's Milkbread, and I'm top of my class in the architecture department at Kale University. I am Chocolate Chip Cookie, Master of Engineering at Cookie College. Behold, the goddess of design and decoration, condensed milk syrup. With all our powers combined, <sighs> building the perfect playground is as easy as pie. Uh, what are they supposed to be exactly? Hmm. I'll have to draft up a completely new rendering. Right. Hmm. <laughs> yes, now that's what I call postmodern design. Oh, how delightful. Design reviewed and accepted. All that's needed is for me to beautify it with a dazzling dessert decor for a rather avant-garde look. Uh-uh. If you make it too extravagant, the construction will be impossible. What? How dare you spit on my delectable design? Uh, Tacky engineer. What did you say? Uh, guys, guys, my brilliant teammates are fine, huh? When gifted minds like us join forces, we make the world more beautiful for everyone. I'm sorry, partner. It's okay. Hmm. We're cool now, partner. <laughs> cream of the crop. Mm. Hey, cheese. Are you just going to stand there and stare? Huh. Come and help us out. Uh, all right. Team, mm. let's construct mm. the greatest playground ever built. One, two, three. Huzzah! Ah! Ah! <laughs> hey, make sure that one's steady. <laughs> We did what the blueprint said to do. But for the next step, we don't have any cement or paint. Ugh. Oh, I'm so frustrated. Does this mean we give up? Give up? Ugh. We've worked too hard and come too far. Giving up isn't an option at this point. Uh, giving up isn't an option? What's the big idea here? Uh huh? Ooh. 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 I come all this way and the build gets canceled when I get here? We came for none. Uh -oh. What's this? An unfinished playground. Huh. Maybe they ran out of dough, too. We designed this playground together. This is Cheese. We were helping him build his very own playground. A playground? You're just a bunch of kids. You can't build a playground yourselves without the help of us pros. Little guy, you don't need to build a playground. Just go and play in that one over there. No! I can't go back there! The boys in that playground all kicked me out because of my odor! What? They kicked you out because of your B.O.? Those rotten, good-for-nothing brats! Hey, let's help them finish this playground! All right. Yeah, that's great! Let's make this the best playground in Bakery Town! Huh? Thank you so much! Yeah. <laughs> This strut goes here, that beam there. Are they building a new playground here? How lovely, my little one needed a place to play with all of her friends. Thanks for all your hard work. Here, please, you must be thirsty. Well, don't mind if I do, miss. Hello there, youngsters. Huh? Huh? Have some fresh uh -huh. fruit. Whoa. Thanks so much, man. Uh, it's real good. <laughs> <sighs> All done. It looks pretty good. Mm, just hmm. stunning. My work here hmm. is done. Hey, hey, don't forget that I made it all stand up. It's finally finished. Everyone, let's enjoy the playground together. <laughs> What's that? Wow, look at that new playground over there. Playground? More like an amusement park. Like, it's huge. Oh, it looks so fun. We, we're huh? sorry. Would it be, um, okay if we joined you? We're real sorry for making fun of how you smell. We were wrong. Of course. Huh? I didn't build this playground all by myself, you know. We work together as a team to make it something special. <laughs> Come on, we can all play together. Wow, really? You, you mean it? <laughs> <laughs> what an amazing playground we created. Sausage, 
Thank you, pal. <laughs> Big Boy Wilk. Wilk! Put these in storage now. Yes, Master Bread. And don't forget to throw out the trash, too. Got it. Did you make the whipped cream yet? Hurry up with that tea. Fix this clogged toilet again! Why are my ingredients not ready yet? Get them now! Huh? Hmm. Something's up. Wilk hmm? seems happier than usual today. Ah, uh, so he didn't tell hmm? you? Today, Wilk's parents are coming into town. He hasn't seen them in a year. Wilk's parents? Huh? Huh? <laughs> Hello? Hi there. Could this be Bread Barbershop? Uh, yes, it wow, is. so nice. <laughs> Mom, Dad! Oh, Wilk. I missed you. Oh, it's been so long. How's my boy? Just a sec. Let me introduce uh. you to my awesome co-workers. That's Master Bread. Uh. He's my boss. <laughs> and my co-worker, Choco. Wilk said so many good things about his time working here. Our Wilk looks up to you so much, you know. <laughs> oh, you're too kind. <laughs> And you have a lovely establishment here. <laughs> oh, my little baby boy, you're so hard, don't uh, you? Baby! No, Mommy, I'm not a baby. I'm a big boy. Big boy! Sweetie, can you give Mommy one smoochy kiss before we go? Of course. Smooch! Are you hungry for dinner, my baby baby? How about we get barbecue tonight? <laughs> really? I want it, I want it! Well, we'd like to take our little boy out for dinner, if that's all right with you. Oh, for sure. I'm have a nice time. Thanks a lot, boss. <laughs> Let's go. Does my special little boy want barbecue or chicken? Barbecue! <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you want, sweet pea. Uh, now I get why he acts like such a kid at work. No kidding. Yum. There you are. <sighs> it looks yummy. Not yet. Huh? Let me cut off the burned parts first. But, Daddy, they're the yummiest. Nothing yummy about cancer. Say, ah. Uh. Uh. <laughs> mmm, tasty. <laughs> Have some kimchi, sweetie pie. I'll just wash off all the spicy wicey for you first. No, Mom. Oh? I can totally eat spicy food now. What? My baby eats spicy uh -huh. food? Watch me eat this kimchi, no problem at all. <sighs> Wow! You are a big boy now. Good job. That's my boy. <laughs> Donut Ranger continues. Yay! <laughs> Wilkie, well, time to turn off the TV and get some sleep, Kay. Oh, Mom, not yet. But sleeping is healthy. Instead, how about some story time? Whoa, my old favorite book, The Adventures of Little Milk. <laughs> Once upon a time, many expiration dates ago, there was a brave little boy. Good morning, Choco and Master Bread. Hey, so huh? did you have a good time with your parents yesterday? Yeah, we had a great time eating mm -hmm. barbecue. My dad cut all the burned parts off of my food, and my mom cut the kimchi up for me. And when we got back home, my mom even read me my favorite uh, bedtime story. Ha! Uh, Wilk, <laughs> your mom and dad still feed you when you go out to eat? I guess cutting your own kimchi is still pretty hard. <laughs> well, isn't everyone like that? No way! I'm pretty sure even preschool kids eat by themselves. Mm -hmm. Also, your mom reads you bedtime stories? <laughs> Don't you know how to read? He's a little baby! <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, no, I am not! Oh, no, little baby Jumper! Oh, wait, no. He's a big boy. <laughs> little guy, just go out where we please. Huh? Wait, there's a kid here? <laughs> Not quite. Wilk is actually over 20 years old. But his parents still feed him his food and tuck him in at night with bedtime <laughs> stories. That's so funny. <laughs> That's not all. His mom doesn't let him eat spicy food, so she washes it off first. Oh, too spicy for Widow Baby. I know, right? Wilk, I'm here. Hey, kid. We're not calling Wilk by his name anymore. Now he's Baby Boy. Baby Boy? Yeah, just listen to this. His parents cut up his food and give him what? bedtime smoothies tonight. I thought you were older than me, but you're still a baby, aren't you? I am not a baby! Oh, yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. He's a big boy now. Huh? A big boy? That is so funny!
Johnny! <laughs> <laughs> I'll prove to you all that I'm a grown-up! <laughs> Sweetie, your mommy's here. Master Brett, could we borrow our son for a few hours? Because we thought it'd be fun to bring him to an amusement park. Oh, sure. <laughs> Have a great time. I'm not <laughs> going! <laughs> Those places are for when you're little, not when you're grown. I'm gonna go uh, listen to a philosophy lecture. What? A lecture? What's curdling him? Oh. Wilk! <sighs> Yesterday you said you wanted to go to the amusement park. What's this about philosophy lectures? Mom, Dad, I'm an adult now. No more kid stuff. <gasps> Instead of playing around, I need to work on my self-improvement so I can become a productive member of society. Uh, it's too bad we already bought the all-day passes, then. Since Wilk doesn't want to go, we can give the tickets to Master Bread and Choco yeah, instead. That's probably best. Oh, that'd be awesome. Wait! Not so fast. All right, I'll go. It's financially unwise to let them go to waste. We'll just go for a short while. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yay! We made it! I want to do the merry-go-round and then the bumper cars. Okay, what? what? First love. <clears throat> I remember you love the merry-go-round. And don't forget the bumper cars. Uh, let's go. <gasps> Recommended for ages seven and under. If I write that, they'll call me a baby for sure. Hmm. That ride huh? is for kids, not grown-ups. Uh, we should find a ride that's bigger. Huh? <gasps> I, I want to write that one. <laughs> Uh, you want to go on that ride? You sure you can handle a roller coaster? Well, why not? I've done lots of stuff scarier than a dumb roller coaster. Let's just go. <laughs> I hate this. I want to get off. Wow, that was so awesome. Let's go do it again. <laughs> You all right, sweetie? I knew the coaster would be a bit too much. How about the merry-go-round instead? No! Oh no, is your tum-tum hurting? Should we get you a drink? We could use some water. I'm totally fine, you guys. But if you need some, let's go. Oh, Donut Ranger melon juice! <laughs> you really like this flavor of juice bottle, right? Uh, <clears throat> I'm good, no thanks. Yeah, only little kids drink juice. One copy to go, please. And an extra shot of espresso. <gasps> Whoa, he drinks coffee now, too? It's too bitter, Wilk. The bitterness of black coffee is what makes it all worthwhile. So bitter like life. Well, I knew that coffee'd be too much for you, son. Let's just get the Donut Ranger juice, okay? Mm -hmm. oh, I'm not a baby anymore! <gasps> You two treat me like I'm a little baby. I'm mocked by my boss and my co-worker, and even Cheese started teasing me. Now I'm a proper adult with a real job. And if you don't want to treat me like that, then just go home. I'm sorry, it's just been so long since we've seen you last. We didn't realize how much you've grown. Okay, we'll be going. That's right. See you next time. Was I too harsh? I wanted to spend more time with him while they were both in town. We could have seen the Donut Ranger movie together. Maybe go to the toy store? Or go to an arcade together? Uh, shouldn't have tried to be grown up. It's no fun. I miss my mom and dad. <laughs> Wilkie? Huh? Mom? Dad? <clears throat> Good to see you two this evening. We stuck around because we didn't want to leave our son just yet. Huh. You just want to treat me like a baby, don't you? <gasps> huh? It doesn't matter if you drink black coffee or juice. That's not what makes you a grown-up. Yes, we know you're already grown. You have a job where you work hard. You help others in need. And you're responsible and independent in your own way. Your mom and I are so proud of the man you've become. You're such a mature and grown-up milk now. <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, uh, I didn't like acting grown up. It was no fun. There, there. You can always act like a little kid around your mom and dad. No matter how old you get, you'll always be our baby boy. How about we go see a movie tomorrow? Yay! Or go to an arcade. 
Yeah. In a toy store? You bet, <laughs> sweetie. <laughs> 20 years prior. <laughs> oh, no. He has a typo on his head. It says milk instead of milk. What are we going to do? It'll be fine, dear. This just means he's a special kid. But what if other kids tease him for how he looks? What if he doesn't make any friends? Well then, I guess we'll have to become his friends. Our special little guy, Wilk. <laughs> Princess and Cheese. Wow, that was great! Mm -hmm. Cheese, when it comes to games, you're number one! Hey, you know, anyone can get this good. No way! So far, I've never seen another pastry play as good as you. Well, I'm not a pastry. I'm a cheese, dude. Wilk, we huh? don't want to be late. Mm. Party starts soon. Let's go. Yes, Master Bread. Party? Oh. What kind are you guys going to? Uh, huh? Princess Cake's birthday party is tonight. Cheese, you want to come with? Huh? Yeah, I sure do. <laughs> 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 oh, I'm so awful at these types of games. Huh? Who is it now? Your Highness, may we enter? <clears throat> Come in. <clears throat> your Highness, huh? every bun has gathered downstairs to celebrate your special day. But I don't feel good. I think it's fever. Achoo! And a cough. I won't be able to make it tonight. But, Your Highness, couldn't you at least greet the public or something? <laughs> uh, it's getting worse! Don't you hear my stomach making sounds like a cheap mobile game? Please leave me to suffer alone. Uh, yes, Your Highness. <laughs> now time to play. My word, she doesn't think we'd notice her game addiction. What will happen to our kingdom? <sighs> I love that they got the plate. The food here rocks! It sure does. And I always come here and eat the oomph. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Sorry to our guests, but the princess will not be making an appearance tonight. Do enjoy the party, everyone. But the whole birthday party's just for her. Maybe she's sick. Now, Wilk, this is our chance. You remember why we're here tonight, right? Yes, we are here to promote the barber shop. Let's move. It's go time! Yeah! Wilk, well, wait! You guys are gonna leave me alone? Yep. I need to help Master Bread. Be back soon. Uh, what? No fair! What am I supposed to do at a party where I don't know anyone? Well, at least I have my games. Aw, oh, man, the Wi-Fi is super weak here! Looks like the signal must be upstairs. Huh? I found it! Up here, the internet works great! Huh? <laughs> jump! Turn! Turn! Jump! <laughs> oh, lost that one again. What a hard level. You shouldn't turn left huh? at the end. Good gracious! How long have you been standing there? The oh. nerve! Hey, I'm not trying to be rude. It's not my fault if your fingers are bad uh. in this game. I mean, who can't even get past stage one? Let me show you how it's done. Uh, what the? What's he doing? <laughs> well, wow, that's amazing. I've never <laughs> been able to complete that level. Piece of cake, seriously. How is he so good at this game? So muscly. He must do this all the time. His focus is laser sharp. He must be super smart, too. Smart and skilled. The perfect man. Done! You're up to level 10 now. What? Already level 10? Oh, Mr. Cheese, you're so cool. Uh? Mm -hmm. uh, what time is it? Already six o'clock! I gotta get out of here! Ah, wait, where are you uh, going so uh, soon? Uh, There's a new Donut Ranger on tonight! There's no way I'm missing Donut Ranger! Cheese, please! Cheese! He even loves Donut Ranger as much as I do. He's perfect! Oh, man, I'll never get past level 10. I bet if Cheese were here, he'd help me beat it no problem. 
<gasps> but I don't know where Cheese lives, and I don't have his number. How will I ever get to see him again? <sighs> All that's left is his utterly terrible smell. Hmm. What's wrong with the princess? <laughs> see? It would appear someone has stolen her heart. What? Stolen my sweet baby's heart? Stealing from royalty is punishable by exile or death! No, no ma'am. I mean, she's fallen in love with a certain cheese from her party. She's head over heels and can't focus on anything else. <clears throat> my daughter is incapacitated because of some dumb cheese. That's it. I'll talk to my daughter myself. Oh, my cheese. Dearest cheese. Hey! Mother, what do you want? Sweetheart, how can I help you here? Mommy can make it happen. I just uh, want to see Cheese again. Uh, and if I can't... Uh, servants, uh, find this Cheese uh, immediately! Your Majesty, I'm not sure where we would even start to look for this boy. There are hundreds of types of cheeses in the world. And there are hundreds of ways to lose your job! <laughs> yes, ma'am. Start a search across the entire city. Sir! So why is the princess looking for a cheese? Dunno. But whoever he is, he's a lucky guy. Huh? Whoa! Looking for a cheese who's at the princess's birthday party? That's you, right? Huh? Not me, dude. I don't even know what our princess looks like. Come on, let's go to the arcade. Uh, <gasps> Holy donut holes! They get a hundred million bucks! Who cares? Uh, Nobody uh, needs that much money. They also get the newest snack box one! Snack box one? Why didn't you say so? See you later! Gotta huh? go! Is this where the line ends? Just think of all the games I'll play on that new console! I don't feel well these days. Please leave me alone. We've called all the cheeses in Bakery Town to come to you, Your Majesty. Uh, You're the only one who remembers the exact smell of the cheese, so you'll have to identify him yourself. Are you sure? My lovely cheese would really come here? I remember it like it was yesterday. I could never forget that pungent yeah. smell. Is this the day? Will I finally get to play games with my cheesy game wizard again? Well, bring in the first cheese right away. Greetings, Your Majesty. I'm here for you. Mozzarella cheese, the one and only, at your service, Your Highness. Mm, I don't remember his face being so round. And his scent is way too fresh to be my cheese. Nope. Princess, please wait! <laughs> Why, hello there. My name is Cheddar Cheese. Please experience some of my sharp smell. I'm sure you'll find I'm the one you're looking for. Cheese was more fermented. Not so sharp, a bit more gross. Next. I am blue cheese, ma'am. <laughs> Hi, I'm Ricotta. Next. My name is Imantal. Next. Smoke Gouda. Next. Okay. Next. Next. Next! <sighs> oh, will this mess ever be over? What if I never find my cheese this way? What if he's simply uh, gone? Uh, <laughs> Your Majesty, please don't give up hope now. You know there's many kinds of cheeses left in the world. Surely you'll find this boy soon. I won't. Oh. It's over. I'm just going to be sad forever. <laughs> Is that you, Cheese? <gasps> My Cheese, this is the smell. It's really you. Princess, I'm the cheese you met at your birthday party. At your service. Enough? Oh, cheese, you're finally here. So this random kid is who she was looking for? People have weird tastes. You're looking lovely today. Huh? Cheesy, you'll complete level 10, won't you? What? <laughs> you wanted to find me just to help you win the game? Yes, of course. You can help me complete the game, can't you? Uh, sure. You're the best, Cheese! Huh? Your skills are so cool! <laughs> ah, I can't believe it! You completed the last level so fast! Cheese, good job! No problem. Mm. What are you-
you doing now? From the first day, my heart has been beating only for you. I couldn't think of anything else when I saw you playing that game. Please accept this show of thanks from me. Um... No way! <laughs> no escaping this level! <laughs> Your Majesty! Your Majesty! Are oh, you all right? Seize that cheese! <laughs> Nobody tells her no. <laughs> what the donut's going on here? Hello? 911? Yeah. Everyone here is unconscious after smelling me! What's your emergency? Hello? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> the Barber's Apprentices. Welcome to Red Barber Shop. Choco, let's get a move on. Sure. Where on earth did Wilk go and what's keeping him so long? Master Brad! Huh? <laughs> Wilk, you better have an explanation for this. But, sir, look who I've brought with me. Fred, it's been quite some time. Oh, <laughs> Master, what a pleasant surprise. Hmm. Well, I had some errands to do in Bakery Town, you see. We met in Moldy Breadburg, and I brought him here. <laughs> <laughs> well, everything seems to be in order here. <laughs> well, of course, I was taught by the best. <laughs> oh, who might this be? Allow me to introduce my new pupil. This is Melon Bread. How do you do? Mm. Your new pupil? Mm. After I handed my shop over to you, I mm. decided to take some time off. Mm. Huh? Ha! Ha! Ah! Do it again! <laughs> <laughs> me too, me too! Hey, she's not finished with me! Oh. I couldn't ignore such raw talent, so I decided mm. to teach her. Wow, what a story! Your talent really did blow me away. Hi there, my name is Wilk. Um, I think we should be friends. Uh, hmm. Huh? <laughs> Talk about a cold melon. That's how kids are these days. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm a bit peckish after the trip. Oh, of course you are. <laughs> Don't worry, Master. We'll make you a feast fit for a king. <laughs> I'll grill up some meat. And I'll fix us something to drink. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a pleasure to see you and your shop so successful. <laughs> it's all thanks to your teachings. By the by, I was quite impressed with your assistant. Why, he turned those super molds into super models. Who oh, will? Cross knows I've tried my hardest to teach that milk toast. Hmm. In that case, why don't we let Melon Bread and Wilk have a hair battle? Huh? <gasps> Melon Bread has journeyed from town to town, training to be the best barber. And I suspect this battle will teach them both something. Well, <laughs> still, with no time to uh, prepare. I'd love to. Uh, I mean, uh, I have a ton to learn from Melon Bread. Uh, uh, Wilk! Well, <laughs> we'll meet you tomorrow in the empty parking lot. Uh, Until tomorrow, then. Have a nice evening. See you tomorrow. Oh. Mr. Bread, are you all right? By the way, isn't uh. Melon Bread something? Oh. I got to see her uh. in action, and she is a genius. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Shall we let the battle commence? Yes, huh? I think I'm ready. Hmm. Yes. For the first round, you will carve the coconut. Oh. A coconut? Mmm. A true barber can turn solid rock into living art with their very hands. The mm. first to finish their art carving into the coconut wins the round. Ready, set, begin! How am I supposed to carve through this hard shell? Hmm. Huh. I'll use this instead of scissors. Yeah, let's do this! Who uses scissors on a coconut? At least I'm using my melon. Huh. Uh. Hmm. Oh, she drilled a detailed carving into a coconut in a matter of minutes. You've done very well. I'm honored, sir. <laughs> For gluten's sake! 
No, Wilk! Carving a coconut with a pair of scissors? Can't you do anything right? And the winner is... Melon bread, of course! Wilk, my boy, why did you use the scissors? Well, of course I knew it would be easier to use the drill. But when I pictured the coconut as a customer's head, I couldn't bring myself to carve it with a drill. Oh, so that's why. All right, enough dilly-dallying. For the second round, chocolate syrup hunt! The first to bring back a warm, fresh batch of chocolate syrup will be declared the winner! What? Huh? But I'm a stranger to this neighborhood. I don't know where to begin to find uh, a... Hmm? I think I know huh? a place. Let's go huh? together! Oh. Uh. Here it is, the best huh? chocolate syrup factory in Bakery huh? Town. Oh. Mm. Good afternoon huh? to you, sir. Hi there, <laughs> Wilk. Sir, hmm? might we get a freshly made, piping hot batch of chocolate syrup? Oh, what sticky timing. You see, it's lunchtime now and everyone's on their break. Just hold on for a little bit. I'll be back soon. Sure. Have a nice lunch. Their chocolate syrup is made from 100% pure. <laughs> oh, melon bread, what are you doing? There's no time to waste. Wait, I'm going to grab insane. a batch myself. <sighs> <sighs> Let's do this. Uh, 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 I've got it! Wilk? Did you fall in? Trying to save me? I'm so sorry! Huh? Wilk? I'm okay. I'm a milk carton so I can float. Now you go ahead. I'll catch up soon! Huh? Hmm... Uh, uh, uh. Looks like I made it. <gasps> Melon bread. I can't believe that you waited for me. No one's going to say that I cheated my way to the top. Huh? You can play it cool, but I can tell you've got a warm mm -hmm. heart. What? Hey, you can stand there and keep babbling, but I'm out of here. <laughs> Wait for me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Master Bread, we're back. Huh? <laughs> At the same time? <laughs> and what took you so long? <laughs> Funny story, I was clumsy and fell into the syrup barrel. Oh, why am I not surprised? In that case, huh? we'll have to call this round a draw. A draw? Does that mean I won? No, the last ah. round will determine who wins. The ultimate feat, the 100-tier ah. fruit ah. tower. 100-tier fruit tower? Impossible. Ah. The first to make a tower with 100 ah. tiers wins the match. Let the final match begin! In order to build a tower that tall, I will start with the largest fruit at the base. Huh. Hmm. Well, watermelons, it's you and me. Cantaloupes above them. And then the pineapples. Melon bread seems to have a great hmm. stacking tactic. Hmm. Indeed. Uh, looks like I'm going to take this home. Almost. Huh? Huh? Oh, no! Huh? Oh. 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 My head. What in the gluten was he thinking? Oh, you imbecile! Hmm? You had no tactics! No wonder it collapsed! Uh. <laughs> I completed the task! I can't believe she completed it so quickly! Astonishing! Hmm? A job well done. Wilk, mm -hmm. you can come down. The match is over. Uh, already? Let's have a look at Wilk's tower, shall uh. we? What am I even looking at? It has no tears. It has no shape. Did you have any plan at all? Hmm. I hereby declare the winner is Melon Bread. <laughs> Nitwit, you didn't even win a single round. <laughs> I'm sorry I let you down, sir. Tomorrow we're going to start back at square one! Sir, I'll try my very best, sir! Bread, mm. you keep taking good care of the barbershop. I will, sir. Hey, Melon Bread, congratulations on winning! Hmm. You were a worthy opponent. I'm going to work so hard so I can challenge you again next time. Does that sound like a deal? Hmm. Hmm. That sounds like a good deal to me. All right, now, we'd better go or else we'll miss our train. Uh, 
Have a safe journey, you two. Bye, <laughs> well, now that you've battled Wilk, how do you measure his skills? At first, I thought he was just a clumsy, inept milk carton. But then I realized what a fair, kind heart he has. Still, I'm not very sure hmm. he'll ever be a real barber. Hmm. Are you sure? Huh? Unlike you, Wilk didn't use a drill in the first round. Instead, he used scissors because he thought of that coconut as the client's head. But... but that... And then in the second huh? round, as you know, Wilk was kind enough to help out his opponent. Uh, how did you know? <laughs> There's no way you would have chosen to return together. <laughs> For the last round, Wilk could have finished quickly by stacking the fruit as you did, but it took him longer because he was trying to come up with a meaningful design. Here, take a look. Huh? That child was making a 100-tier statue. The outcome of the match isn't what's important. It's how you respond afterwards, whether you win or lose. You won this battle uh, fair and square, but I'm curious to see who wins next time. <laughs> I finally did it! Time to go! Ooh. Master Pen! Uh, 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 you waited for me all this time? You're the best! Um. I wasn't waiting for you, I just dozed <laughs> off. Master Fred, wait for me! Here I come! <laughs> <laughs>